How's it going everybody? Decisive TV here. I'm back on our Let's Play world and today we're going to go ahead and do uh, a little bit more building. Last episode we created our, uh, if I can see it from here, yeah there it is, our little like ruined wizard hut thing, uh, like half tower <laughs> or whatever. Um, so we have our enchanting table in there and last episode we enchanted our first diamond pickaxe, got a fortune three or yeah, fortune three efficiency four on it, which was awesome. Uh, but this episode, I did want to do a little bit more building. Um, so I had this idea of maybe we create kind of like a, a little resort sort of area so that we can just go there. We can kind of, you know, get away from everything around this this base and just have like a little area to relax or something like that in our world. I think it would be pretty cool. So, of course, um, what I have planned for it uh, requires quite a bit of leaves, a little bit of wood. We're just going to make like a, I think, a little cafe or something like that. But, of course, we have to find the area first. Uh, I haven't explored the world too too much um but i do know that i kind of want to make it uh, i have to go this way right yeah i uh, kind of want to make it back towards spawn i want it to be kind of like an in-between point between spawn and our base here uh just because like if i do die and i have to respawn all the way back at the world spawn that would kind of suck to have to come all the way back uh, actually, oh, shoot, come here, sheep. I'm going to use you for a temporary bed, I think. Where, where's your friends? I need more wool. Is that one? No, that was a pig. Ah, well, I see them over here. All right, and to, uh, to or towards spawn, we go. So I think I kind of want to make it pretty simple. I want to have like a little cafe uh, next to like an outdoor seating area, but I also kind of want it. Oh my god, this is super cool I kind of want it to also be Fairly sus like self-sustaining I guess at, like as a cafe. Oh my god What is this? <laughs> this is awesome terrain generation. I mean, there's uh, the gateway to your mom's house, but um, the, the rest of this looks super awesome. What the heck? Oh my god, and there's a village up here. I didn't even realize. What? Wait, wait a minute. How are we? How am I just now realizing this? Our base is right down there. We have a village. And the river leads towards the village that way, but we have a village right up here. I never knew. Hello, villagers. Uh... It's not a whole lot. I'll go ahead and take the bread, I guess. I don't know what I can do with long grass, but... Interesting. Oh. Is there anything else? Oh, a horse. Um, I actually... I did want to tame a horse. Okay, there's like nothing in this village. What the heck? This is like the worst village I think I've ever seen. <laughs> what is that? How is that possible? What the heck? How are there seeds on path block? Okay, you know what? Uh, I did bring a saddle and I did bring some horse armor. So I do oh, uh, I do actually want to tame a horse. I kind of want to get around a bit quicker around our world without having to use a boat. Oh my gosh, please just... Yes, thank you. Okay, this horse seems pretty fast. Okay, it seems pretty slow. Are you a good jumper? Uh, not really. Let's see how the other one is. Or a black steed. Okay, well, you tamed really quick, so I don't have much hope for you. Okay, you're even slower than the other one. Nice. Okay. Let's... We'll just... We'll use this horse for right now. It's not the best horse. Definitely not the worst. But, and there's a ruined portal down there. You guys can't... Okay, well... Here we go. Well, I guess there's... Oh, my God. I guess there's uh, some more village houses down here. Nothing except for long grass and seeds. Cool. Oh, no. I don't want those. Hi. Okay. We made it safe. Is there anything in here? One emerald. Thank you. 
Man, if I was on a server, I would think that somebody al already looted this place. What in the world? Uh, yeah, I guess we'll just take our compass. It'll point us towards spot. <gasps> Wait, there's more horses over here. Uh, oh my god, I'm sorry guys. I like I know I should be going towards spawn, but these horses are just... I need them. I need them in my life. Okay. Oh man, this one seems fast. You can kind of tell whenever they're walking around like this, whenever you're trying to tame them, about how f how quick they'll be. And this one seems insanely fast. I think it's whenever you're taming them. Oh my god! Just love me already, please! Okay. Alright. Oh, this one's a fast one. Holy smokes. Do I have, like... Uh-oh. I don't know if I have uh, mini HUD or not, so I can like see its actual speed. So let's let's compare. So whenever this horse walks around, it's pretty quick. It's faster than that one. So I think you can tell whenever they just trot around, like they're roaming around. See how fast they are? See, that one's quick. That one's super slow. See how fast it is. See if we can notice a difference. Oh, wait. I already have this one tamed. Oh, this is the one that I brought over. Oh, I'm silly. Okay. Well, we will just take that off and throw it on you. Let's go. My new steed. Oh, my God. I would like to find a nice beach spot. These are like insane cliffs. How in the world did I get over here? Can I boat? You know, honestly, that right there, you can like barely see it through my horse's ears. <laughs> that looks like the perfect spot for what I want to build, to be honest. And like something like that, like a little, what the heck is this? What is this terrain? It's just like, oh my God, I feel like I'm in like, I don't even know, Greece or something. Or like the Mediterranean Sea or whatever. Okay, well, there is a... Oh, my God. Uh-oh. Horse and tree don't work. There is a jungle over here. I do kind of want to get some jungle leaves for the build. Maybe a little bit of bamboo. I should have taken some from our house, but... Oh, this is pretty cool. Yeah, I think... This, actually, this area might actually work. I think. Stone shores. Yeah, somewhere around here, maybe. Uh, let's go ahead. I don't have much inventory space, so I kind of want to set up. Uh, I think I might go on that island. Can I punch my horse? No. I, I don't know if that's a good thing to question or what, but... Uh, I don't have a lead, so just don't wander off too far, horse. And like the, the minute that I'm gonna be away. What the fuck? Oh my god. What the hell? Dude, that looks sick. What is this terrain? What is this world? Oh yeah, somebody was asking for the uh the seed. Um I think it might have been in the last video in the comments. I, I can't remember. But if you guys do want the seed, if this video gets I'll, I'll just I'll say 20 likes if this video gets 20 likes I'll give you guys this the, the world seed at least I'm pretty mind blown by how this world looks it's like 90% jungle for most of it and then you just like get into all this crazy weird stuff um but yeah so I think this is where we're gonna set up shop I kind of wanted something like this we might change all the stone out to grass to be honest uh eventually like once we get more enchants on tools and Maybe a beacon. Uh, I don't know. Uh, we'll, we'll see. We'll we'll go with the flow. We'll see how it goes. Um, but I am going to set up shop. Yeah. And I do actually need to get a bunch of jungle wood anyway. Uh, because I want to set up a cocoa bean farm or the cafe and sell cookies, I think. I was talking about that the first episode whenever we made cookies. Or got cocoa bean. I can't remember. I know I was talking about setting up like a shop or something that would sell cocoa beans. Oh, and there is a little bit of bamboo. 
Mm. Well, this kind of sucks. <laughs> okay, my horse did not make it at all. Can I, like... Yes. This works. Oh. Come on, horsey. We're gonna keep going. Keep her, keep her going. Oh, we're almost there. I believe. So you guys might be wondering to yourself, why... Uh, decisive. Why are you... Why are you making a, another base, technically, I guess? Uh, it's a resort, first of all. But... Ow. I'm making uh, kind of like a little resort sort of base. Um, just to kind of symbolize, you know, sometimes people need breaks from life or uh, that sounds kind of bad they, they need breaks from the i guess the real world you know it's taking a vacation sometimes or taking some time off of some stuff to kind of recollect and gather who you are and uh what you want to do as a person uh is pretty important to do and i think i think everybody should always take some time to figure out what they they want for themselves and to figure out uh, who they want to be in their lives. But, um, you know, sometimes uh, you don't really get the leisure of uh, getting a break from, you know, school or work or uh, just people always hounding you. Um, and I, I think it's, I think, you know, sometimes it's all right to just say, hey, I need some time. <laughs> oh, yeah, I should probably gather up some of the jungle, jungle stuff. Maybe maybe we should grab some vines as well. Probably. Oh, oh, my God. Oh, well, I made another pair. Let's go ahead and grab some of these. Probably really loud. Sorry. So I kind of wanted to make something that kind of resembled like a little a little miniature resort here in our world. Uh, something that we can just chillax to. I can come chill it and chill in the Minecraft world with uh, the Minecraft vibes. Maybe play some Minecraft music while I'm just sitting here thinking about life. Something like that. <laughs> something deep like that, you know. Okay. All right. Come on, horsey. We gotta make the we gotta make the the trek back. Uh oh, that is not what I wanted. Oh, okay, made it. Oh, this horse doesn't jump too bad either. That's awesome. Oh. Uh, actually, wait. Do I? I don't think I want to bring the horse on the island. That would not be. A... Eh. Come on, please. Eh. There we go. Okay, stay there, horse. I'll be back. Okay, so I think uh, we should make, where do I, which way do I want to look out at? Do I want to look out at the Plano Ocean or do I want to look towards the land? I think the ocean would be better, right? So maybe we have like clear out a little bit of space here, but we have our Okay, I did not expect my shovel to break. I should have made another one. Um, maybe we have like our, our little outside area, like right here. I don't really need it to be too big. So maybe something like this, something this big. Um, but I do want to have it connected to the cafe. I think that would make sense, right? So maybe the cafe would come out to like around here, right? Uh, do that. So the little outdoor area is around here, but the little cafe area is right here. Luckily, we have a bunch of stone shores around here, so I do need more coal so I can smelt up a bit more stone. Uh, but luckily, we have a whole bunch of coal around here, so I don't need to run all the way back to the base to get some. Oh, boy. 
Hopefully we can get back before mobs start spawning. Oh, it's already starting to get night time. I'm so scared. Eh. Okay. By the way, I want to give you all a round of applause for the amount of support on the last episode. Holy shit. You guys are... Uh, also, I'm, I got this raw piece of iron, and I'm going to make a shovel out of it because mining dirt with hand kind of sucks. Uh, but the, the support, like, give you guys a, a back on the, or a pat on the back. That's what I'm trying to say. That, it's just insane. The, uh, the amount of support, the, the amount of comments I got that are just so kind. Like, man, it is, it, it is something to have. Uh, a community like how I'm growing it right now. It's absolutely special, and I can't thank you guys enough. It's just, it, it's really, really cool. And this episode, I think, is going to be a bit more deeper. Um, kind of, I, I don't want to get too personal, <laughs> obviously, but uh, right now something is going on, and uh, it, it's just, you know, it, this world is kind of a way out. Uh, and playing Minecraft and playing video games is kind of something that distracts me for just a little bit of time uh, so I don't have to worry about schoolwork and I don't have to worry about uh, the the other thing that I got to worry about. Um, so in making these YouTube videos, I can connect with you guys. And uh, if you guys are feeling the same way, then, uh, you know, you guys kind of resonate with that as well. Um, actually, I think the outside area, which should make a... A little bit different for these, right? So maybe something like this. Do that. Maybe we do like that. And then just have our oak slabs like so. Maybe. Something like that. Yeah. Would that look okay right here? Yeah, that'll probably look fine, right? Uh, so I'm Yeah, that's right. You can't place bamboo like that. Shoot. I, I really wanted to use the bamboo as like uh almost like fence posts. That would have been awesome. Actually, maybe we can do that. Maybe we just do well, the thing is, it's not going to be centered, right? No, I think I think it would look cool. <laughs> I'm going to try it. I mean, there's no there's no sense in not trying it. So I think we do something like that, and then I need to make a bunch of fence gates. I really hope I don't have to go get more wood. That would suck. Is that how you make? No, it's the other way, the cheap way. So fence gates, do that. We can make a bit more to that. Okay, so maybe we have it going like this. And yes, I know that grew. Um, yeah, so maybe we have something like that. And then we do this. Over here too. So then those won't grow anymore. Uh, and then I think we just have the fence gates on the other side as well. Wonderful. Okay, let's go ahead and clear this out. Clear out this dirt so then we can put the floor in for the cafe. Um, I kind of feel like I want a door here, but at the same time, I kind of just want it to be like a little archway, maybe. Mm. That's a hard decision on how I would do that, at least. So I think the pattern I want to make is just a pretty simple pattern. Nothing too fancy. Just a little bit of checkers. <laughs> Perfect. Okay. Uh, let's go ahead. Think I can do 
this bit now. No. I can't believe I just did that. Oh my god. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Oh, I hate that. <laughs> I hate misplacing glass of all blocks and I just don't have silk touch. Oh, that's unfortunate. Okay. Uh, well, we're almost done with like the the base layer, I guess. Um, let's go ahead. I think I want to have an offset door, right? So just do... Don't worry, Pro Builder Joe here. We'll do, I think, probably a pretty simple roof, right? I don't want, I don't want to make this a complicated build. I just like, kind of like simplifying the builds, having like a little, sometimes they look a little bit like shit, but you know, sometimes you just, you gotta, you gotta make it through the shit to get to the, to get to the gold, right? Also, I ran out of oak wood. <laughs> I'm upset. I didn't want to go get more, but I have to go get more. And it's almost nighttime, but for some reason it's not nighttime. Let me in the bed. Let me in the bed. This is one huge motherfucking branch for this tree. What the hell? Like intersected with this birch tree. What the hell? Uh oh, and it's a thunderstorm. That's awesome. Okay, well, I don't need to gather up too much more wood, so we might just leave this, like, half broken. Don't tell anybody. This is a weird tree. This is, like, a, a fat boy, a fat boy tree. But it's also, like, really big. Okay, we'll do that. That should be enough. Uh, oh, that one. Okay. Let's go ahead and finish up this roof. We'll sleep so the bitrate isn't absolutely murdered. All right, there we go. And it resets today, which is very nice. Uh, so all we have to do is just get a bunch more glass. Um, I also... Uh, actually, wait, I think I have wool, right? Yes. Let's go ahead and get some wool. We'll make some sticks as well. Uh, we'll make a couple paintings. Kind of want to throw those inside here. Can I? Can I get like a a three? Oh, you know what the the Giga Chad brain move is? Make glass panes. Don't make. Don't use full blocks. I'm I'm stupid. I'm dumb. I can't believe I've done this. Let's go ahead. Boom. There we go. Let's go. That all right, we only need four more. Very nice. We only need four more gloves. So I think we should just do something. I may maybe jungle planks would work as well, but I kinda wanna I kinda wanna do a checker pattern with these. I think that would look pretty cool. Uh so after that then it would I don't even know. Maybe it would just be like this. So it would be kind of go like that, like that, like that, like that, and that. Something like that. Maybe. <laughs> I don't know. That kind of looks a little bit random, a little bit shit, but you know, it, I like it. I like how garbage it looks. It's fun. Um, I think we should also put. Something like that. Something to protect us. Because I know the mobs are going to want to get inside. Well, I only needed six more, so I just wasted three planks for nothing. Cool. Uh, all right. So these jungle and oak leaves, I kind of want to make like an awning sort of thing. I think would be pretty, pretty dope. So I can just kind of place like a random assortment of leaves everywhere. Uh, maybe we go up on top as well. See what we can do up there. Kind of want to have it like 
walking off the edge. Yeah, I think something like that. And that looks pretty cool. I kind of like that. A little bit of detail. Uh, let's go ahead and make the rest of these panes real quick too. So that that's finished now. Okay. Uh, door. Dora meets Explorer. Um, just make... Actually, do we want a an oak? Or do we want a jungle? I think a jungle would look better with this, right? Maybe, like, make it go in. Yes, I think we do. Uh, this part I also want to change. Maybe we change it to, like, a jungle plank or a jungle stair. Boom. Yeah, that looks better. Should we... All right. Let's go ahead and put this stuff back in here, clear out an inventory a little bit. Um, I also planned on setting up a... A uh, little chicken farm, um, but I think I think we're starting to run out of time for this episode. Uh, I got some other stuff I got to do today, but uh, I think this looks pretty good. Uh, oh wait, yeah, that's right. I kind of want to some fence posts. Do that. Uh, I I wanted to set up some chairs. So if I grab these, you know what? Fuck it. <laughs> it could be like this. Uh, you know, I just realized this is probably in the way. Uh, actually, I think I'm going to move this over one, right? That would make sense. Let's go ahead and do that. Boom. Table. Oh, there we go. Okay, let's go ahead and we'll do that. Boom. And now we have our little chairs. We have our little table. Sick. <laughs> Awesome. Well, that, uh, I think, um, oh, wait, I have one more touch that I want to add. But I got to go get it. Maybe we place some lanterns around here so we don't get mobby mobs spawning around here and we can actually see. Oh, hi, you're my first customer. Are you? How, how, how are you? How are you doing? Oh. What a rude bitch. Can't believe it. Dude just left. Yeah, you better leave. You're not welcome here anymore. Oh, yeah. Uh, we should probably put some mines around, right? Probably not too many. Because I know they can spread to weird spots. And sometimes they can get out of control. But I think having a little bit of greenery... Oh, my God. I almost, you almost just made me force look at you. And you, you would have been mad. I would have been very mad. Uh... Yes, so next episode, oh wait, I should make more lanterns, right? At least one in here. That actually worked? Wow. Yeah, sure. Fuck it. <laughs> uh, so next episode, well, we got the cafe built, we got the little outdoor area built. Um, next episode, though, I want to go ahead and finish this up. I'm just running out of time today, and this video is already starting to go on for a little bit. So, uh, I want to add the farms down below. I want to add a cocoa bean farm so we can make cookies, add a chicken farm, maybe a pumpkin farm as well. Uh, so then we can also make pumpkin pies around here if we want. Oh my god, you have a grass block. Oh, that's cool. Um... But yeah, so this is kind of to symbolize, uh, uh, like, you need, you sometimes you need a break from everyday life. Okay, Enderman, you're getting annoying, dude. Go away. Go away. As I was saying, this is supposed to symbolize sometimes you need a break from everyday life. Uh, you know, sometimes everyday life can, can catch up to you. It can, it can overwhelm you, and sometimes you just need a break. So, uh, I, I'm not saying you have to go spend a vacation somewhere, but... Uh, you know, just giving yourself some time to figure things out, figure yourself out isn't an entirely bad thing. And um, just make sure that you keep your loved ones close by and keep your friends close by as well, because they'll, they'll help you through many, many times um, where maybe sometimes you're struggling with a certain situation or uh, sometimes there's 
there's somebody in your life that, uh, that you know, you're, you're wishing the best for them, but maybe you're beating yourself up too much. So, you know, it just, you, you got to take some time for yourself. You know, you got to chillax. You got to relax. You got to, you got to eat some pumpkin pie or some cookies sometimes. Right. So yeah. Anyway, that's going to be it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy remember to hit that like button down below. Subscribe if you're new here. I will see you all in the next episode. Thank you so much. Have a good day. Bye-bye.